The Rosenberg trial is the sum of many stories. A story of betrayal, a love story, a spy story, a story of a family torn apart, and a story of government overreaching. The Rosenberg trial was a lengthy and controversial espionage case. In 1950, the FBI arrested Julius Rosenberg, an electrical engineer who had worked for the U.S. Army Signal Corps, and his wife Ethel. They were indicted for conspiracy to transmit classified military information to the Soviet Union. In the trial that followed, the government charged that in 1944 and 1945, the Rosenbergs had persuaded Ethel's brother, David Greenglass, an employee at the Los Alamos Atomic Bomb Project, to provide them and a third person, Harry Gold, with top secret data on nuclear weapons. The chief evidence against the Rosenbergs came from Greenglass and his wife, Ruth. Both Julius and Ethel Rosenberg were found guilty and received the death sentence. Morton Sobel, a co-defendant, received a 30-year prison term, as did Harry Gold, and David Greenglass was later sentenced to 15 years imprisonment. Despite many court appeals and pleas for executive clemency, the Rosenbergs were executed on June 19, 1953. They became the first U.S. civilians to suffer the death penalty in an espionage trial. Many claim that the political climate made a fair trial impossible and that the only seriously incriminating evidence had come from a confessed spy. Others questioned the value of the information transmitted to the Soviet Union and argued that the death penalty was too severe. Fifteen years after David Greenglass's prison sentence for espionage, he finally returns to a quiet home where he can relax. Or so he thought. Ah! Julius! What you thought that was it? You thought you seen the last of me? Well, surprise, David. I thought I got rid of you 15 years ago. What are you doing here? I'm here for revenge. Revenge? I was a brother to you. A brother? What type of brother are you? You are the reason why I'm dead. Me and your sister. Remember her? I was just trying to help. Oh, you were the one questioned by the FBI. They were only worried about you. Why did you have to mention that I was part of the Soviet spy ring? You don't want to go down alone. Well, David, I can't believe you would do something like that to me. Even worse, your sister. Your own flesh and blood ethics. How could you do this to us? Sorry, it was a mistake. Well, I guess what I'm about to do is going to be a mistake, too. I'm sorry. No! <laughs> David Greenglass provided information against the Rosenbergs to the FBI so his wife, Ruth, would be able to stay and take care of their kids. David believed that Ruth would be safe because of this. But little do they know. Justice has been served.